Good morning, Meadowview. It is Monday, November 22nd, 2022, and this is Meadowview News. It's only a two-day school week this week. Be prepared to do your best and show those great student skills for your teachers. Some important life skills you should show while at school include cooperation, effort, responsibility, integrity, and patience. Put those into practice this full week of school. For the weather this week, it appears that if the temperatures outside should warm up a little bit. With that, you can expect some wet days. The showers look to start today and continue off and on all week. While you are at school for the extra long holiday weekend, be sure to find a cozy blanket and maybe a good book to read. On to sports. The Oregon Ducks and the Oregon State Beavers both have a game this weekend. The Ducks have an away game and the Beavers have a home game. Okay, but who are they playing if the Ducks have an away game and the Beavers have a home game? I think you know the answer to that question. Ducks play against the Beavers on Saturday. Good, Good luck, Ducks and Beavers. Next week is a full five-day week, and there are hopefully first days of the second trimester. Hopefully, you have taken care of any missing test scores or missing assignments. That is right. For all of you middle school students, these last two days of the trimester are important. Be sure to check in with your teacher if they are allowing missing work to be turned in. The next message is for all you 7th and 8th graders that are interested in participating in this year's yearbook committee. Applications will be introduced and available next week. Please talk to your teacher about how to access the yearbook application. Applications will be accepted from November 28th through December 2nd. What's going on? Before we say goodbye for today, let's cut to Miss Dodds for our new weekly Wolfpack shout-out segment. Happy Monday, Meadowview Wolves. Principal Dodds here. Hope you had a great weekend. It's a short week this week. I've seen a lot of our students being safe, being kind, and being responsible as we uh, get after it these last few weeks before a longer break. Uh, please know that we're watching you do all of those great positive uh, things that are really affirming our school-wide expectations. All right, so come to my drawing. Drum roll. All right. For elementary, I've got in Miss Ailey's class, third grader Gabriel. Thanks for being safe and kind uh, coming in from recess um, and lining up and just doing a great job there. So good job, Gabriel. Come see me for a prize. The next one in elementary is from fifth grade, Miss Reef Harper. Nice job being kind, responsible, and safe in your classroom uh, each and every day. So nice job, Harper. All right, and for my middle school wolf pack shout outs, we've got Avery Kessel, eighth grade. This is from Miss Lipkin. Um, thanks for being responsible. Avery was always helping and has been continuing to help put away recess equipment. Thanks, Avery. Again, come and get your prize. We've got some gift cards, some Meadowview swag. All right, and the last one, the second middle school will pack out it is for Seamus from Miss Wren. Um, Seamus was being kind by supporting a friend through a difficult interaction that happened in class and for reaching out for adult support to help continue to solve the problem. Nice job, Seamus. All right, the four of you, please come see me for your prize. Thanks for continuing to follow our school-wide expectations. Have a great week, Wolf. Thanks, Ms. Dots. That was great. That's all for this week's broadcast. Have a great week, Winnowville, and remember to be, be kind, be responsible, and be safe. safe.